good morning guys and welcome back to my channel if you are new here welcome and a very happy 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 new year to all of you guys who are new and the returning subscribers so this is going to be a weekly vlog today is monday it's about quarter past six in the morning and i'm just gonna quickly go and get a workout in i'm going to the gym downstairs in my complex i'm not gonna go to virgin active but a very very happy new year to all of you guys i really really pray that this year is better for everyone and if it's not better then may we be better i'm just gonna make a quick coffee and then i'm gonna go and work out cute are these mugs um for those of you guys who keep asking on like my instagram and stuff the majority of these like pretty mugs that i get um are from h&m home and then there's some that are from at home to be honest with you i prefer the h&m home one this one for example is from h&m and and i prefer them because they're like so such better um quality compared to the at home ones like h&m home really makes like really good quality stuff and i love this mug now um i took a shower and i'm dressed and i'm about to start working today is my first day back at work so i probably have like e emails is the one million but i'm gonna start tackling them now i'm just wearing this like blouse this is from poetry i've had this blouse for like probably a good two years it's such good quality so it's still like perfectly intact it's a little bit tight around here because the gut says has just gained so much weight but yeah i'm wearing this and the reason why i decided to wear like a blouse is because i have some meetings today and i just want to look presentable because it's like virtual meetings though they can literally just see this part upwards so i think i look presentable i'm not wearing makeup i'm a little bit like torn with the makeup because i want to wear makeup because i feel like it just makes everything look so much better and also i want to practice my makeup skills but at the same time yeah do right makeup guys like I don't want to waste my makeup if I'm not going to be going anywhere. I'm just going to be in the house all day, you know? And because I have like the concentration span of a goldfish, I'm going to leave my phone in my bedroom and go and work in the office so that I can actually focus today throughout the day. So there's two main things I need to get done this week. I need to go to a gynecologist so that I can put in my contraceptive. I am that 27 year old that has never ever used a contraceptive. The one that I'm considering the most strongly is the Mirena IUD, but I just need to like properly consult with a gynecologist um, before I like make my final decision. But to be honest, it's probably gonna be the Mirena IUD. If not the Mirena, then maybe the Copper IUD. One of my friends um, from Cape Town, Marsha, she said to me, Uti, the Mirena costs like 3,500 Rand guys and i should music and i also have to pay for like a gynae appointment so that she can prescribe me the marina i have to pay for that and then i also have to pay for the procedure to like insert it also is moving in soon so we need to go and get a desk for him there's only my desk in the office and we're going to get him the same desk that i have just in a different color i have the white 
um, I think it's the Manchester desk. I'm gonna try to put a picture of it here, the white one. I have the white one. And then we're gonna get him the black version of the same disc. Yeah, and I also need to go look at it. That's what I'm doing this week. But for now, my niece is it, guys. normal rice because I'm doing low carb and you won't eat cauliflower rice and then this is the butter chicken that I made and it's got some butternut oh it looks so good so good
So today is Wednesday. It's a little bit of a gloomy day in Joburg today. If you can see that, it's quite gloomy. But I'm glad because it means it's not going to be like as hot. It's still quite warm to be quite honest, but it's not going to be as hot. And because it's warm, I have like my portable air cooler slash air conditioner on in the office. I just turned it on now because I'm about to start working. It's eight o'clock. Um, I didn't vlog yesterday because yesterday was just too chaotic. Like. I didn't even get a moment to pick up the camera i was working all day and then on top of my full work day i spent like six hours editing my lower negotiations vlog i think that vlog in total took me about 12 hours to edit yeah but i think that's probably because i'm still like a bit of an amateur when it comes to like making youtube content so maybe with time like it will get better and i'll become more efficient but anyways, it's Wednesday today. Let me show you guys my attempt at looking presentable today, aka my OOTD. So this is my OOTD. This is a dress I got from Woolworths. Guys, when I say to you, Ubuti, Woolworths comes through for the big girls. It comes through. I really like this dress. It's quite like airy, but comfortable and it's like appropriate. I can wear it when I go out. I can wear it at home when I'm just chilling. I really really like it but yeah that's my work outfit of the day let me go and sit at my desk and start my work day so in my attempt to become like a little bit more productive every single morning I write down like a to-do list of like what my to-dos are for the day and like to try and not overwhelm myself too much I actually try to only put three items on my personal to-do and three items on my work to-do. And then only if I'm able to get those three things done, then I can add more things to like my list, yeah. So I'm just gonna start off by putting together my to-do list. Oh, gotcha. So the three items I wanna put on my personal to-dos, I want to go and fetch my wedding dress from Brian Co. And then I also want to go and buy Tebuho's desk. Um, cause it's gonna be moving in soon. Um, and I only have one desk in this office, so we're gonna need two. And then I also have to send out very important communication to my friends and family about the wedding. Yeah, that's my to do for today. Um, and then I can't really share my work to do because my work is like confidential, so I can't really share that. But anyways, let me get my day started, and I will catch up with you guys later. It's like lunchtime. It's like one o'clock. I've been fasting for 18 hours. So I'm about to break my fast. But I'm not as good thing because all the food I have needs to be cooked. And the food I can make like quick quick, I don't have like I have one egg. Like literally I have one egg. I have like some salmon, like some leftover salmon from yesterday, like smoked salmon. That's not even a meal. I'm the little wine, the salmon, that's not even a meal. Maybe I can make a smoothie, man. Yeah, let me make a smoothie. I'll have, I'll have this one egg. <laughs> I have this one egg. My smoked salmon, and then I'll make like a smoothie. Yeah, I think I'll do that.
so that's my lunch i've got some smoked salmon and an egg and then i've got like a low carb very very low carb smoothie and in this delicious delicious smoothie i've got some blackberries uh, collagen protein powder mct oil cream chia seeds and maca powder and that's my lunch for today mm. the smoothie literally never disappoints me like it's so delicious and if you're wondering this is the collagen protein part that i use i typically get this from clicks and it's about 300 rand yeah i get this from clicks it's like the best collagen i've tried so far and it tastes really really good but yeah i really enjoy this so i just got here and from that that's what i'm gonna make Although I really like using Devoho's car, I think I actually just scratched it. He parked too close to the wall. But although I really like using Imo Dega Devoho, this chair is too far back. First of all, what is this music? <laughs> what is this music? Every time I switch on the car, there's this like Indian music that's playing in this car. I don't even understand what you, like where this man finds this music. But anyways, um, as I was saying, as much as I like using Tebukho's car because it's so much nicer than my car and so much bigger and so much more pleasant to drive, I kind of have to use it right now because my license disc is expired and the cops in Joburg, like they're everywhere. Especially like here in the Santon area, they're literally... Let's switch this thing off. What do I switch this off? Mute. As I was saying though, um, as much as I like using Debojo's car because it's just so much nicer to drive, it's bigger, it's so much more pleasant. At this point, I kind of have to use his car because my car license disc has been expired for about two years now. And in Cape Town, I could avoid it and just use, oh, this thing is making so much noise. In Cape Town, I could like get away with it because the traffic cops don't like roam the streets every corner you turn but here i'm talking about like the cops are everywhere like everywhere so i don't want to get arrested i don't even know if you can get arrested for not having a license disc that's like current um i did try to go and like renew my license disc a few weeks ago maybe like three weeks ago i got to the post office i queued guys for like an hour and a half and then when i got to the front this lady said to me would say i must go back to cape town to go renew my license disc and i was like what you mean sis and then she's like your car number plate is ca so you have to do your license disc in cape town i'm like that doesn't even make sense and then she's like i'm like and then i asked her why can't i do it here and she was like because as a zazi calls us a cape town but yeah, basically, I either have to go back to Cape Town to go renew my license disc or I have to go and change my number plate. But in order to do that, I have to go to the to the traffic department. And then I tried. So, to the, so the traffic department here, you can't just walk in. They don't take walk-ins. You have to like um, 
book online so i tried to book on the online system and you can't book to renew your license test like you can book for other things like your driver's test your license test etc but you can't book for your license disc <sighs> um yeah and then i called them and then they ended on answer i spent like 200 rand a time um holding with their intercom dundons and nobody picks up basically yeah And so I don't have a license disc, so I have to use this car that does not belong to me. I'm going to Brighton Co. I'm going to fetch my dress from Brighton Co. Because I don't want to leave it there the whole. I'm going to fetch... Ooh, tis a one. Yo, Ivo, why is the car reversing? Hi, Sana. You know what? My clutch control is not intact at all. I bought my dress in November okay. and then I left it here because I was going to come back this month for alterations okay. but okay. it's been my wedding's been postponed so I just thought let me come and fetch the dress okay no problem um, and there was also the veil yeah in ivory yeah like the moon is the sun we don't care about the others you say Dress. I'm just gonna put the uh, what you call it the GPS now so that I can go to the furniture place. Um, this friend of mine, she's also my fiance's friend's girlfriend. She actually just recommended a gynae to me, a black female gynae. So I'm gonna phone her now and make an appointment for tomorrow. Good day, you're speaking to Zizi Po. Um, is it possible for me to book an appointment with Alright, so her soonest available slot is next week Tuesday. Oh my, she doesn't have a slot available tomorrow or the day after or Saturday? No, she doesn't consult on weekends at all and she's fully booked for the rest of the week. Okay, okay, next week Tuesday is fine. Um what time is she will she be available? Thanks then, bye. Basically, I need 10,000 rand to get this contraceptive. I think I'm going to die. Like, I think ugh, I need to call Devo. Can't. I can't. I'm not going to be able to pay for that. You know what? Hey, I'm going to pay for that. This is our time. This is our time. This is our time. This is our time. I can't. So I just got to at home, like, clearance center. 
and my soul is not at peace with this money and Utobeka from church just DM'd me and said that e copper IED is 200 rand so I just want to find out how much it is hi um it's Zippo speaking I just called a few minutes ago to make an appointment um I want to find out is the insertion price any different if I if I opt for the copper IUD instead of the marina um, or is it the same Asking about the copper pearls, right? Yeah. Is it not an IUD as well? It is. It is okay. an IUD. Okay. Um, let me see. Yes. So the price would still be the same. Um, it's just that you have to pay for the copper pearls, right? Yeah. I think the, the only one that's different here is the implant. If you were getting an implant, then it would be less. But all the intraurine IUDs are all the same. Okay, including the Kylina as well. Yes, the Kylina as well. Okay. All right. Okay. All right, All right. Thanks. 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 Bye. One thing about me, and you copy ten thousand for That that that's that's what I'm not gonna do. That's what I'm not gonna do. I just got it at home, and I'm gonna go and console myself by buying this piece of furniture. I know this money that I'm about to buy this desk with, we could probably use it to get my contraceptive, but you know what? You know what? You know what? And it's like, I'm like 10,000. Never that. Also, I want to try and negotiate the price of this desk. Let me see if I can successfully do it. Where's the car keys? What's here in my bag? I have never done that. How do you take it? Is that not how you. I die for now. I die for now. I die for now. I die for now. I die I die for now. 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 Um, it's around about lunchtime. Didn't vlog the first half of the day because I just had too much going on. It was way too busy. But it's lunchtime now. I'm about to eat and then I'm gonna continue working and then after that I'm gonna go to Santon to go run a couple of errands. I need to go to Discamp, to Clicks and to Checkers. Um, but I can't go yet because I still have quite a bit of work to do. Udebuho is here. He just made us lunch. So let me go and eat. Thank you, Lavi. I'm coming on the glass. Huh? Oh, that's not the oven, that's a microwave. Makes it goes off your account. <laughs> Uber Eats is at your door. <laughs> what? You just said burger. <laughs> and because you've had guac and bacon burger 65 times, the oh. algorithm assumed that you're going to have it again. In time. And because you've got money in your account <laughs> and you're the kind of person who would buy a burger even if you're broke, <laughs> according to your spending, burger at your door. <laughs> burger at your door. Hmm? It smells like pot. <laughs> it smells like a neighbor's sack. Okay. Okay. So I'm going to Santa, I'm going to get some groceries. They were just walking into the car. Is there a reason why you're walking into the car? Are you going to get rid of all the seats that you left in the car? Yes. Yes. Yes, you are. Yes, you are. I'm out here trying to be thin. And this man is always leaving sweets in the car. Baby, every time. Every time I go to your car, this is like this. I'll wait. He could pick him I'll wait. Your butt's too big. My butt's too big to fit in there. Please don't park like this, dog. I'm not going to go front. Because now when I'm coming to use the car, I can't get in. You see, it is, the, the, the door is scratched there. It is. You like to play. Shintiza. Ah, ah, na ma, 
Yeah, as I was saying, I'm going to the mall. I'm going to Santon. I need to get a few things from Discam and then I need to go get some groceries. Um, the has been here the whole day today working and he still has to work. It's half past four and now I'm pretty much done for the day, but he still has to work. So I'm gonna go by myself. Um, I'm at this like little center. I haven't gone to the mall yet, like to Santon City. I wanna come and buy, I want I wanna get this um, marinade that I once saw at this disc camp. And I haven't seen it at any other disc camp. So I'm hoping it's a corner up. It's like a low carb marinade. I wanna make um, chicken wings tonight for dinner. So let me check this out and see if it's here. Take your time. I'm on a high, high. My body yearns for you to touch me. No. There's magic in your fingertips. It's magic when we kiss. I can be myself with you. Kiss me now. Make me yours, just take me now I'm helpless to resist Got me so invested in this thing It's more than just a fling It's more than just a fling It's more than just a fling So yes. Okay So I bought these sweets Which claim to be low carb These ones are marshmallows and then these ones are wine gums and they claim to be low carb let's see nutritional information so per 100 grams they have zero carbs okay so they're sweetened with maltitol and sorbitol These a taste test. These are the wine gums. Oh, they smell quite nice. It's not bad. It's actually pretty good. <laughs> Guys, it says Alpha excess consumption may have a laxative effect. That doesn't sound good at all. Um, let's taste the marshmallows. I must put a about these actually. Wow. Guys, these are actually not bad at all. Let me take a picture of these and send them to Unam. These are not bad at all. Like, de impressed. Keep on getting much darker Even when 
Do you warm up the oven? Yeah. Okay. I'm here, love. Please come get the groceries. Okay. Alright. Did you marinate the chicken? Not yet, I was about to. Okay. Good morning guys um so today is friday it's the work day and it's about half past eight i went to the gym this morning as you just saw and i'm about to start working um but first before i start working i just need to make like one phone call i don't have that much planned today it's just going to be work i want to do my nails so i want to do like a new manicure at home manicure of course when i came back from doing groceries isolo i was like so exhausted that i couldn't even cook and do a grocery haul before i start working i just need to make like a phone call i want to book a spa treatment tomorrow i want to go do a pedicure and a wax and then you guys saw earlier on that i was a little bit like distraught about how much money i have to spend on contraceptives so you guys really helped me over on instagram and like dm'd me some suggestions so what i've decided to do is that i'm still gonna go and see the doctor like the guy name and then she's gonna recommend for me like exactly which contraceptive i should take i am hoping to take the morena iud or the copper iud but after she recommends like which one she thinks is best i'm just gonna then go to emeristopes and go and do my contraceptive there my cousin and a couple of people on instagram really suggested mary stokes i had a look at their prices at their price list i think good no sent me like their price list so i'm definitely gonna get my contraceptive and get it inserted there but i'm still gonna go to like a private guy me so i just need to call mary stokes to make an appointment i've already made an appointment with the guy me i need to call the spa um Oh, Nom Kosi, a friend of mine, got me a spa voucher to go to life day. But yeah, let me start my day, guys. I'm on hiatus. I'm on hiatus. Mm -hmm. I'm on hiatus. Uh -huh. Baby, don't check for me. Taking time out. Trying to look like you're winning or look like 
like you always be working Soaking the moments you live in, yeah You got the nerve to be on me Faking your life for the IG If you got my number, don't ask me Cause baby, I'm on hiatus I'm on hiatus I'm on hiatus Ooh. I'm on hiatus uh -oh. Baby, don't check for me here and watch Octavia my absolute absolute favorite youtuber like I love this girl so much I think I, I probably have watched every single video that's on her channel and I watch it over and over and over and over and over again love her like if there's one person I really relate to on YouTube it's her anyways let me have my food and then I need to get back to work afterwards baby I'm on hiatus I'm on hiatus I'm on hiatus Ooh, I'm on hiatus uh -oh. so the day is pretty much over it's like five focus on me yeah it's like five o'clock or like quarter to five and i'm pretty much done working for the day i want to quickly run to the stationery shop just up the road from my place and then i'm going to come back and make dinner Debo didn't come over today um so i'm just going to make dinner for myself i might make enough for us to eat tomorrow though because we're going to spend the day together tomorrow but yeah let me go to the stationery shop i want to get a daily planner and i want to get some calendars i need to start my goal setting and whatnot so let me go take my glasses off so today i'm taking my own car because my heart didn't come over today so i'm gonna risk it with my expired license disc but don't worry guys um let me take this off don't worry tomorrow when i come back from the spa we're gonna go to the traffic department um we're gonna go to the traffic department i promise well i don't promise but we're gonna try our best but yeah i'm gonna go to the shops and get what i need and then i'll be back to make dinner do my nails and so forth tell me santa tell me santa Ooh, i think i just want to say hey guys so it's like 10 o'clock in the evening on friday i got back from the shops and i actually did my nails and yes like i've been doing my nails for like a good probably like a year and a half now and for the very first time i actually hate the output like i hate it like i hate how they turned out but it's fine it's only gonna be for like two weeks if not less and then i'm gonna change them um, I don't even know what I was trying to do here, but they did not turn out well at all like at all I don't know how good this lighting is if it's not I'm sorry, but I just wanted to show you guys what I got At the mall before I do that though and to, in, in order to achieve these nails that I do not enjoy um, I use these two nail polishes from Essie um, this pink one is called 
Moochie Moochie and then the white one is called Marshmallow. Um, the majority of my nail polishes are from Essie and I love Essie nail polishes. I ride or die for Essie nail polishes. It's just that this particular manicure just didn't work out. It didn't work out. But yeah, I went to Exclusive Books and to Typo. Um, at Typo, I got this like gigantic daily planner. Absolutely love this. Um, it's a 2021 daily planner obviously and i think it's made out of like recycling paper i don't know if you guys can see that this paper is like a little bit brown it's not brown it's like cream it's like cream it's not like white white like normal paper um but yeah i got this planner and i really appreciate the fact that it starts at 6 a.m because most daily planners start at 8 a.m and i actually start my day at 6 a.m but yeah, I got this planner. I think it's so beautiful. It's got like a faux leather cover. So this is the planner. And I think it's absolutely, absolutely stunning. Love it. It's got like pages that are just like the full month. And then it's got like obviously the daily planners. And it is a daily planner. And I'm probably going to use it for both work and for like personal stuff and then i got some like a4 white cardboard because i want to make a vision board i might make a vlog next week that contains a little bit of that but yeah i've got some white cardboard paper and i bought a4 because i actually want to like have very few goals this year and like simplify them and be very specific and then i also want to frame it um so yeah i'm probably going to use pinterest and instagram and like my own pictures to create the vision board and then frame it i got some contact paper as well as some gift wrap but i'm going to use this gift wrap to actually cover a book Udeboho and i obviously because we're getting married next month we're going to be kind of combining our personal finances so i'm going to use this to cover the book where we're going to kind of write down our financial plan our financial goals for the year for the upcoming years for the long term etc but i'll show you guys that in another vlog and then i got a packet of these and then I got a packet of these like fine liners. I used to be obsessed with fine liners when I was in school. In fact, not just when I was in school. I've always been obsessed with fine liners. I'm still obsessed with fine liners. These are the best colored pens ever known to me. They're by Stadler. Oh my gosh, and I love them. And these ones are the 15 pack. In high school, I used to buy the 12 pack. But yeah, this is what they look like absolutely love these pens and they come in a bag of 15 they also come in 12 in 20 24 and 36 obviously like the, the the larger the number of pens in it the larger the what you call it like the more of the spectrum of the rainbow that they cover but guys i've been obsessed with these since i was a little girl i literally use these throughout like um high school and university even as a working woman i still use these my other pack is kind of like dried out some of them are lost and so forth so i just wanted to replenish and then i got oh, old faithful between our guys like i have been using big pens i think since i was in grade four and i have never looked back these particular ones in fact the blue ones i use these throughout primary throughout high school throughout university and even now as a working woman i'm still using big old faithful who needs parker when there's big and then i went to h&m home you guys know i love collecting tea sets so i got this like really really cute pink tea set that i'm so excited about so this is the saucer yeah, corn. and it's actually so nice and big that um because it comes with like a miniature cup you can put the cup literally on the side and then have like your cookies on there but yeah this is the saucer and then this is the little teacup how cute is that guys how cute is that and then it comes in a set like that basically comes in a set like that so what I was saying is that you can put your tea cup like to the side like that because this um, theme of it is kind of relatively flat. It's not like curved, it's relatively quite flat. So you can put your tea cup here on the side and then have your cookies or like your muffins here. 
but yeah you know it's this actually just inspired me i'm gonna go and make myself a cup of tea and i'm gonna read my book let me actually show you guys the book that um that i'm currently reading right now so i'm reading this book called total money makeover by dave ramsey it's actually the second time i'm going through this book my fiance actually bought me this book and he read it already i'm reading it again so that we can talk through it but yeah that's what i've got at the shops and with that being said i am going to close this vlog here guys i'm exhausted i need to sleep i think it's like almost 11 o'clock yeah in fact it's 10 past 11 so i'm gonna end this vlog here i hope that you guys enjoyed it if you did please consider subscribing to this channel and i also do make personal finance content on a channel called because it's about dollar and i have linked that channel in the description box below so please do check that out thanks so much for tuning in guys bye Mm -hmm. I'm a high